Hi friends, welcome to second video of Fish Assert in this C5 for Finance and Operation. In this video, you will learn that how we acquire assets. Suppose our business acquire a car of 65,000 USD and later this car is registered in a fixed asset. So for first of all, we go on account payable and we can create a complete purchase order process. But for shortest, I record a vendor invoice. For this, I go into a ven pending vendor invoice. And here I create a new invoice. And I acquire a car from Best Player Europe. I entered the invoice number is something 991 and invoice description if you want fix asset fix asset and from procurement category i select a vehicle and then select a car click ok and quantity is one unit is ea each and each unit and from unit price i mentioned 65000 and this is line amount so i for our depreciation purpose i registered the invoice round in in july 2020 so I can generate a depreciation in the next video. So I required 7, 1, 20, 20 and same date I use in posting a date. Before going further, I go on a financials and view accounting entry, which accounts it will be hit and here is a transaction transaction is the euro sorry i was i was saying that 65 usd so but uh, here i registered six, uh, transaction in euro so you can see vendor balance is hit by credited by 65000 and purchase expenditure is hit by 618900 i copied that account so that account will be hit when i am going to acquire a fixed asset so after that i save and post this transaction so our invoice is posted now i'm going to fix asset module and here i create a new fixed asset So I create a new fixed asset about a vehicle type and that vehicle I will use in my business day to day and first I select the fixed asset group here I select a vehicle and vehicle line is created and its name is vehicle to day to day operations. Uh, from type is a tangible major type is vehicle it's a fixed fixed asset property type and from technical perspective you can enter as you want is it for example technical information serial number model and from insurance if you have insurance then inf insurance information can also be stored into a system and location on which location it will be when it received and where it will be shifted and I save this fixed asset if we go to its valuation there are multiple books attached but we are most interested in straight line service life and you can see its net book value is zero and acquisition is zero 
so now we have to go and acquire this asset for this we have to go in fix asset journal and here i create a new fix asset journal of current type and in lines I acquire a fixed asset and from I created a ninth and book is automatically coming and offset account is this but I want to post into the parking account for purchase expenditure so i change it to that account and if i i acquire the date 7 1 2020 and from and debit amount is of 65000 i post this transaction Operation is completed if I click on a vouchers. Show me these accounts hit. Tangible asset, fixed asset increase with this amount, debit amount, and retained earning is credit, miscellaneous expenses, tangible, these accounts will be hit as a result of this transaction posted. And now if I go back to Fix asset and if I see the valuation, you can see the acquisition is sixty five thousand and its net value, net book value is sixty five thousand. In the next video, where I will share you how to record the depreciation against this asset. Thank you for watching.